I volunteered at my son's kindergarten class twice. There won't be a third time. <laughs> the first time, the teacher asked me to take the kids to the innovation lab. I don't know what the innovation lab is. I certainly don't know where it is. <laughs> but she told me the kids know the way. Oh, yeah. so they didn't. I just took a little tour of all the water fountains and bathrooms. <laughs> So the second time I volunteered, I took an in-classroom assignment, helping the kids make leprechaun traps. <laughs> this was not a thing when I was a kid. When I was growing up, we celebrated St. Patrick's Day by wearing green and eating potatoes, becoming alcoholics. <laughs> Also, I do not need my son's school to invent new things for him to believe in. <laughs> like, I already regularly forget that I am the tooth fairy. <laughs> I, don't, I don't need any more whimsical overnight chores. <laughs> I show up, I immediately know I've made a mistake. <laughs> These kids do not know any more about building leopard contracts than they do about finding the innovation center. <laughs> There's a kid hysterically crying in the corner. And the teacher tells me to go help him because she doesn't know me. <laughs> My husband left. And, uh, so I go over and try to figure out what's going on with this kid. Between sobs, he tells me that he's worried his trap isn't going to work well enough. <laughs> and um, he has to catch a leprechaun tonight, because if he doesn't, he won't get to keep all of its gold. <laughs> yeah. Look, I know that kindergarten has a lot of hours to fill, but they really should send home a permission slip before they start the unit on kidnapping and extortion. <laughs> you guys are great. Thank you. Thank you.